Hi, in this tutorial let us see how payments can be accepted using Stripe Payment Gateway from our WooCommerce store. Stripe Payment Gateway for WooCommerce plugin can accept payment using credit card, Apple Pay, Alipay, as well as Stripe Checkout as the various payment gateways for your store. Let's get started with the setup of the plugin. First of all, install and activate the plugin. You can navigate to the settings page directly by clicking on settings or by clicking on WebTOF eStripe from the WordPress dashboard. The plugin provides certain useful links like country list, create Stripe account and get API keys, which will take you to certain pre-setup details prior to configuring the plugin. First step in setting up the plugin is to enter the Stripe credentials. We have a couple of modes for configuring Stripe. Beginners can start off by using the test mode, carry out various transactions, and verify it's working. Later configure the live mode when found satisfactory. In either case, you will have to enter the respective publishable key and the secret key. You can get these keys from your Stripe dashboard or from the developer menu. Let's copy the test API keys and paste it in the respective fields. Next let's move on to Stripe settings where you can enable the Stripe gateway for your customers. Let's look into what Stripe overview is offered with. It is in the overview page where you will get a consolidated report of all your Stripe transactions. In fact, you can monitor the total amount captured, uncaptured, or refunded within a specific period of time. You can also view the graphical illustration of the captured payments. Moving down the page, there are order details and transaction details. You can directly manage your orders from the order details tab. You can straight away capture the payments. Process partial or full refunds. You can change the order status individually by clicking on the concerned status or, in bulk, by selecting an item from drop-down. Transaction Details lists out all the transactions done via Stripe. You can process the refunds from here also. Moving back to the setup. Give it a suitable title such as Pay with Credit Card and a short description. Both of these will be visible to your customers at checkout. You can change the order button text too. Choose the preferred cards from the list for which the payment has to be accepted. However, transactions using cards other than the one listed here will be restricted. Let's move on to the checkout page and see what we have set up so far. You can see the title, description, button text and the logos of the selected preferred cards on the checkout page. Now, let us configure Stripe Actions. If you select Capture Payment Immediately, the payment will be captured immediately on successful completion of the transaction. Leaving it unchecked will require the shop manager to capture the payment manually within 7 days from the Stripe Overview page. This method is used to place a hold on a card to reserve funds from the card holder and then capture them after your business completes the service. For example, a hotel may want to authorize a payment in full prior to a guest's arrival, then move the money when the guest checks out. You can see that the payment will be in on-hold state, which when captured will complete the transaction. Likewise, you can capture the payment from the Stripe dashboard also. Enabling email transaction receipt will send the transaction receipt as an email to the customers. Statement descriptors are used to provide an additional information for the customers, which will appear on their bank statements to identify payments and charges. Stripe also supports Apple Pay. You can accept payment from cart or checkout page by choosing respective options. Specify an appropriate description. Position the button to above or below the order button in the checkout page. Alter the button color to white or black. Change the button text to any from the drop-down. Assign a separator and even set a language by entering its codes.
On configuring, customer will be able to purchase using Apple Pay from checkout. Enable the logging option. Each transaction information will be saved into the log file. You can see the file path and the size of the log file which will help you to track disputes easily. Once done, you can save the settings. Let us see how an order can be placed using Stripe Payment Gateway. You can see that the order is placed successfully. Next in line is the Stripe Alipay, which can be configured from the next tab. As a prerequisite, ensure that the Stripe credentials are filled in appropriate fields. Begin by enabling the gateway, then, you can key in with a suitable title, description and order button text. You can see an additional option Alipay at the checkout. Next, let's navigate to the Stripe checkout settings. Prior to configuring the settings, ensure that an account name is specified in the Stripe dashboard, as well as the Stripe credentials are entered in appropriate fields. Then key in with an appropriate title, description and order button text. You can see an additional option, Stripe Checkout in the Checkout page. Unlike the normal Stripe, in Stripe Checkout, the payee will be redirected to the Stripe portal for completing the payment. The order is successfully placed using the Stripe Checkout Payment Gateway. Now that the Stripe Gateway setup is complete, you can offer a fully SCA-compliant 3D Secure, Credit Card, Apple Pay, Alipay and Stripe Checkout payment options for your customers from your store. Thank you for watching.